हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो आई विल टेल यू अबाउट द नेचर ऑफ फ्रूट्स इन द क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन दिस इज फॉर क्लास इलेवन दिस इज द आई हैव टेकन द रेफरेंस ऑफ द बुक अंडरस्टैंडिंग आईएससी मैथमेटिक्स बाय एम एल अग्रवाल क्लास इलेवन चैप्टर सिक्स एक्सरसाइज सिक्स पॉइंट थ्री नेचर ऑफ रूट्स बट यूर द सम डिफरेंट थिंग अबाउट द नेचर ऑफ रूट्स एज यू नो इन द क्वाड्रेटिक इक्वेशन ए एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस बी एक्स प्लस सी इज इक्वल टू जीरो द नेचर ऑफ रूट्स डिपेंड्स अपॉन द डिस्क्रिमिनेट एंड डिस्क्रिमिनेट दैट यू नो बी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी तो b स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी एंड देर आर दी वैल्यूज इन द क्लास टेन यू हैव रेड देर आर दी कंडीशन इफ कंडीशन वन इफ b स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी इज इक्वल टू जीरो देन रूट्स आर इक्वल and real this you have read in class 10 about the roots about the uh, b squared minus 4ac and about this quadratic equation so i will explain in uh, detail the different thing that you have not read in the class 10 the second point that also you have read b square minus 4ac is greater than 0 when roots are real and unequal here the roots are equal and real and here the roots are real and unequal the third thing if b square minus 4ac is less than 0 then roots are imaginary and unequal so these are the three things that you have read already and now i will tell you about the other things in this section means point 2 Point two, where the roots are real and unequal. <coughs> As you know, the real means having the rational number and irrational number. Both the union of both the numbers, both type of numbers, called the real number. In this case, if we have, means can you have the? Um, Uh, rational number are irrational number and in which condition you will get i will tell you the condition wise case one if b square minus 4 ac is a perfect square number perfect square So what you will get? You will get a rational number. Then the roots are rational and unequal. For example, for example, suppose inside the means that this is the formula. Minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac divided by 2a is equal to x for this quadratic equation. See that. If you are getting the perfect square number, for example, 25 inside the under. So under root 25, the value of under root 25 is 5. So you can write minus b plus minus 5 upon 2a. And then we'll one value with the plus sign and other value with the minus sign, and both are the rational, not the irrational. So this is the case. 
if you get inside the under root a perfect square number means this is a perfect square number then roots are rational and unequal second case case 2 if the b square minus 4 ac is not a perfect square number then the roots are irrational irrational and unequal for example the same exam uh, i will take the formula b square minus 4 ac divided by 2a for example you are getting suppose 6 inside this under so whether you will get the uh, rational Look, yes, the exact value because of the you will not get the exact value that is why it is called the irrational number and if it is an irrational number then you will say that like this minus b plus minus under root 6 by 2a so minus b plus under root 6 by 2a one root and minus b minus root 6 by 2a is the another root so in this case you will get the two irrational and unequal roots. So this is the case where b square and in both the case b square minus 4 ac is greater than 0. Because this number is greater than 0. Hoga. So this is the case. Now the third case for the if b square minus 4 ac is less than 0. Is less than 0 what is the meaning of this? In this case, if b square minus 4 ac is less than 0, it means you will not get a number which is rational or irrational. Well, suppose for example you are getting minus 6, minus 25, even, even minus 25 also the negative sign inside the under root is meaningless, means you cannot determine. So if you cannot determine, so this you can only imagine. So this is called, this type of number you, uh, you can say this is the imaginary number. In the complex, in the chapter, previous chapter, I have told about the imaginary number or complex number. So this type of roots in which you get inside the under root negative side, this is called the complex root or imaginary root. And imaginary root always in pair. For example, in this case, minus 6 to minus b plus under root minus 6 upon 2a is one root. Minus b minus under root minus 6 upon 2a is the another root. So always you will get the two roots, two values of them. But if in any question it is written the one root of equation to be a equation b a is 2 plus i one root is only given what is the another root the second root will not be given in the question you have to take uh, uh, by your own the second root because always the complex root and the irrational root always comes in pair so the second root will be its conjugate means 2 minus i is the second root. It will not be given in the question. Yeah, one root is given in the question, but the second root is not given in case of the complex one. So you can say the second root uh, is its conjugate. So conjugate is it? So for example, one more example, if you have the uh, uh, 3i minus 2 is the for is a is one root of the equation quadratic equation ax square plus bx plus c is equal to so what is the second root the second root will be minus 3i minus 2 only change the sign of the imaginary value not the real number i have told already in the complex one in the complex chapter so this is the method to recognize the rational roots, irrational roots, complex root, imaginary roots, and equal roots. Now, the some questions I want to discuss here. Exercise 
पेज नंबर ए थ्री सेवन जीरो ए थ्री सेवन जीरो द क्वेश्चन विच आर बेस्ड ऑन क्लास टेन ओनली दैट इज वन फोर फाइव सिक्स ये सब क्वेश्चन है इन दिस क्वेश्चन बट इन वन क्वेश्चन आस्किंग द लाइक क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टीन एंड फोर्टीन इन दीज द यू हैव दिस इज गिवेन द रूट फॉर वॉट वैल्यू ऑफ के इज ए परफेक्ट स्क्वायर इज ए परफेक्ट स्क्वायर मीन्स द रैशनल नंबर मतलब बी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी इज ए परफेक्ट स्क्वायर इज ए परफेक्ट स्क्वायर मीन्स द वैल्यू ऑफ रूट आर इक्वल अगर कोई परफेक्ट स्क्वायर के बारे में कह रहे हैं तो इसका मतलब कि परफेक्ट स्क्वायर मतलब कि फॉर व्हाट वैल्यू ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन इज ए परफेक्ट स्क्वायर एंड द फोर्टीन क्वेश्चन इफ द रूट ऑफ द इक्वेशन आर रियल एंड डिस्टिंक्ट रियल एंड डिस्टिंक्ट का मतलब है कि इन दिस केस दिस इज द ग्रेटर देन जीरो देन फाइंड द पॉसिबल वैल्यू इज ऑफ एम so these are the question in which you can do question number 9 in this prove that the equation x square plus bx minus 1 is equal to 0 has real and distinct roots for all real values of has real and distinct roots. तो इट मीन्स फर्स्ट यू फाइंड द ए बी सी तो ऑन कंपेयरिंग विद एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस बी एक्स प्लस सी इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो ए इज इक्वल टू वन बी इज इक्वल टू बी एंड सी इज इक्वल टू माइनस वन वी फाइंड फर्स्ट यू फाइंड द बी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी टू चेक द रूट्स फोर ए सी सो इट विल बी पी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए एंड इन टू माइनस वन इट विल बी पी स्क्वायर प्लस फोर आई एम आस्किंग प्रूव दैट दिस दैविंग द रियल एंड डिस्टिंग रूट फॉर ऑल वैल्यूज ऑफ पी अब बी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी इट डिपेंड्स द रूट डिपेंड्स ऑन दिस बी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी एज यू कैन सी and you know the nature the points of the nature of root if it is greater than zero then real and distinct real and unequal distinct means unequal can you say about the um, anything about this p square plus 4 p square is positive number always positive because it is a square 4 is this is plus 4 always positive so what you will say about the p square plus 4 It is always greater than zero because both are the positive number. So any value of p, whether you put the negative value of p or whether you put the zero, one, two, three, minus one, minus two, minus, always you will get greater than zero. That is why this the equation has real and distinct root with by uh, by the with all the values of p. This is the value. This is the answer. Second, the uh, question number ten in this x square show that the roots of the equation x square minus two m plus one by m x plus three is equal to zero has the r real for all real values of it. Well, it's going to be real the one I have. तो फर्स्ट वी फाइंड द सेम थिंग बाय द सेम वे द ए इज इक्वल टू वन बी इज इक्वल टू माइनस टू एम प्लस वन बाई एन एंड सी इज इक्वल टू थ्री फाइंड बी स्क्वायर माइनस फोर ए सी सो इट विल बी माइनस टू एम प्लस वन बाई एम का होल स्क्वायर दैट विल बी एम प्लस वन बाई एम होल स्क्वायर टू का स्क्वायर एंड दिस वन माइनस फोर इंटू Uh, a one and c three, so that is three. So if you simplify, what you will get? M square one by m square plus two minus twelve. Take this uh, four, or you can say the um, 
This term you can uh, put into common m square plus 1 by m square plus 2 minus 3 and then 4 this 4 m square plus 1 by m square minus 1 but also this expression you have to change into the proper square can you write this one m square minus uh, 2 and plus 1 yes you can write okay, minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 there is no change in the push, uh, solution but uh, form is changed only and this up to here you can write m minus 1 upon m whole square plus 1 now what you will say about this one? This is positive number always. Always positive number because it is a square. And plus 1 is here. Plus 1 so always positive and greater than 0. If it is greater than 0, it means this is always real. So this by this way you can show the real number are in it. Other yet any negative Buddha, if suppose you are getting the negative, then it is always the negative number. But it should be definite means in the definite manner you can say that this is negative. Because in this case we can say this is the positive always. Therefore, it is the real uh, the equation as only the real rules. Thank you.